Welcome everyone to Junos with Just a Commentary. So we're gonna check out a video again from Bangkok first time of course. I'd like to thank you guys for requesting this video. Subscribe to Junos with Just a Commentary. Like us on Facebook. Follow us on Twitter if you want me to react to video. Leave a comment below and I try my utmost best to react to it. Thank you very much. Let's go ahead. Okay, so let's see. Dun, 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 dun. Nelson Howe, Master of Philosophy, New York. Comedy. I lived in Bangkok for three years. This is the story of my first three years. time. First time in Bangkok, three years. A lot of interesting stories. Let's hear what this one's going to be about. Mm, let's see. Before I came to Thailand, I thought uh -huh. Tom Yum was the main dish, just like fast food in America. Okay, so I but guess it's actually, like food this one. I Finally. I eat it frequently. You know how long I've been waiting for the request? How am I supposed to know? When somebody I guess this is Thai Bangkok food, first time eating food in Thailand. Tom Yung Gong Dai. Tom Yung Gong Dai. Tom Yung Gong Dai. Oh my god! What is he asking? I generally eat this soup like Russians drink vodka. But living in Thailand led me to know the culture of eating here. I would say <laughs> the real national dish of Thailand is Kapao Musab. Kapao Musab. I can write it on a list of the most delicious food in the world. Thai food is a combination, a symphony of taste. Uh -huh. Sour, sweet, salty, spicy, a roi sat sat. <laughs> what I admire more than food is uh -huh. where to get it. Where to get it. So that's the one. I, I have I to think tell you this. I got his Street foods in Thailand are really cheap. Yeah, someone told delicious. me to watch this video long ago, America, but I got the wrong link. You're limited link. to eat only what's in the menu. You cannot uh -huh. change or adjust anything at all. No, you Thailand, can't. Let your imagination free. No frame. <laughs> no rule. No menu. You can well. eat whatever you like. Ordering <laughs> Thai food is the best example of customized service. It's so freestyle that even 50 cents cannot improvise like this. Doing plain food, then flip the pan and making sophisticated Italian food. That chef is just incredible. Wow. I saw that colorful way of ordering food here. <laughs> the magnificent ability of the Thai chef. So I gave it a try. Let's see. <laughs> yeah. Uh, the carbonara pizza, please. With crispy uh, crust, extra cheese, uh, no pepper, and no anchovy. <laughs> Immanuel Kant once said, hmm. never mess up with the person who is carrying a huge hot frying pan. Hmm. So I decided to go easy with a simple dish. And? Omelet. <laughs> Omelette, please. Her order in Thai food is so Oh boy. After I tried a lot of versions of cook to order foods, I've learned how creative Thai people are able to order foods for their meals. Uh -huh. To get only one dish could be very detailed. Very. So I practiced very damn hard. It looks to order very Thai detailed in preparing it. I stayed right before the noodle cart and said confidently, Sang Lak Hang Kao. I could see the waiter shocked at my pro So I went a little further. More meatballs, no vegetable, no bean sprouts, <laughs> and a Coca Cola. Let Kiao Hang Chin me pack them up, Pope. Oh boy, let's see. <laughs> I can't believe buddy. his nervous system responded and functioned automatically after receiving the order. 
<laughs> there was any supercomputer chip implanted in his huh. brain. His muscle movements transcended the limitations of the human body. Hmm. But finally, uh, there finally. was a mistake. Oh boy. Finally found his Achilles heel. Or does he mistake? I mistake? think I should give him a lesson by ripping him off. <laughs> Swedish. Swedish. I, I told you. <laughs> oh my gosh. There was a Thai saying, Oh, wow. The more the restaurant is <laughs> down to earth, the more delicious the food can be. <laughs> I wow. just saw a scenery of white food, <laughs> smell, unsanitary scent in the air. <laughs> All of the things that challenge the world oh, organization standard, I can tell right away uh -huh. this restaurant is holy grail of Kamyong huh. Kong. I went straight into the restaurant, uh. and I knew it. Coming to Thailand this time would be worth everything with this legendary <laughs> Tam Yong Gung. I ordered Tam loudly Kung. and confidently. Hey, what's hey. Tam Yong Gung? Right here. Uh. <laughs> Let's see what was his reaction. It was delicious, wasn't it? Eater, suck. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this dude is so so. Fuck, fuck, fuck. fuck. Say, say again. This dude is just so so odd. Out of place. Fuck. Go get a chocolate. Go get a. Go get a. Oh, boy. Fuck. Oh, uh, uh, boy. No, not fuck, fuck. Okay. So is that a kiss? Man took met. Okay. Tolly song, fuck. Man took met. Oh, boy. Bangkok's first time, right. That is a good one. As I told you guys that um, Thailand has the richest smile uh, in the world. The richest Thai smile. smiles are very So as I told you guys, I got a video request to want to react to Bangkok first time. It was supposed to be like a street food kind of video because I got that request after I started watching videos from Mark Wayne. And I never was able to find this video. Every time I actually look for the video request, and even with the links being sent, it was about Thailand's um, the ghost, the smile, the curse words, these sort of things. But I finally got Bangkok first time eating in Thailand, of course, street food Thailand. Guys, thank you so very much for requesting this video. Don't forget, if you want me to react to the video, leave a comment below and I'll try my best to react to it. Subscribe, of course, to Jun Swedish Commentary. Like us on Facebook, follow us on Twitter. If you want me to react to the video, leave a comment below and I'll try my best to react to it. Thank you very much. Bye, guys.